The active dog socializing tips. Let's go. Let's not put our dogs over threshold right when we walk in the store. Find a cozy spot and just hang out a while. Notice how trainer Haley is positioning herself in this corgi in a way that nobody could approach unless it's from the front. Both sides and the back are completely covered. This is because reactive dogs don't like surprises. Find stores that have a lot of these, especially right when you walk in. They're low traffic, you can escape, and nobody can pop out and approach you. Exhibit A, child and mother. Hannah and Bean moving away from the trigger. Hannah also tucks her nicely in a heel position. And Dooney and I play goalie. Jelly Beans, that corgi, is a little less outward with his reactivity, where Bean goes zero to hero in 0.5 seconds. Notice how trainer Hannah with the glasses and hat on is now scanning the environment to see where her escape routes are. But she's remaining calm and continuing to remember to reward her dog. She sees the kid behind and she skirts on out of there. Haley's keeping an advantageous position between her and this kid. And you can tell, Jelly's a little stressed. He's confused. He didn't want to break heel there. Just some encouragement. No need to correct. Getting up the stairs really stressed Bean out. Watch her body language. She's very darty. She's low. She bumps into Hannah right there. Her ears are pinned back. She's still taking food, which is a good thing, but very quickly disengages and is looking around, licking her lips, displaying a lot of stress. So we go back to a nice closed off area and let her decompress a little bit. And we get her re-engaged with some really, really simple high reward exercises. This is why engagement in reactivity training is so important. And look at that, Bean offering a wave all on her own as she smashes the camera out of my hands. But we're not going to correct that. We like that. We'd rather her engage with us than her environment. Bean is a bit more dialed in, so Hannah put her in a down. And now Jelly Beans, the corgi, with Haley is practicing some tricks too. Just making sure that he's engaged and having a fun time. I just want to take this second to mention that while these dogs have e-collars on, they were not used throughout this whole trip, actually. This was really stressful. This was hard on them. Another handling tip right here. Bean is it's doing fine. And so Hannah steps into Bean to get closer and then steps away from Bean when the guy moves away. And lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of food. If you have to walk down a space where both on the left and right side, people can pop out out of nowhere, I would rather be on the side where it's closer where people are going to pop out rather than putting my dog on the side where people are closer to them when they come out of the aisle. Then somebody was making a really insane noise over and over and over again, which nearly put Bean completely over threshold. Hannah did her best to do food play games, tossing the tree, putting them on the ground. But as you can see, she's just freaked out, lip licking, engaged, disengaging. Hannah tried with just a little bit of leash pressure to say, hey, look at me. And she really couldn't. She was so stressed. This is not what we want to see. So what did we do? We grabbed hot dogs. We upped the value of reward saying, hey, I know this is hard for you. I'm going to help you out a little. We said, we got to get the F out of here before Bean explodes. Trigger stacking is real, my peeps. But when we got to the escalator, there's a stampede of people. So I played goalie and Hannah put Bean in an advantageous position and just rewarded the heck out of her. Girl, you are doing a great job. Keep going. Still hot dogs. On our way out, I played goalie to the side. I also kept watch for people coming from behind. And when we got outside, we ended it with some decompression. Sniffing really is a stress reliever for dogs. So we just tossed some food in the grass and she sniff, sniff, sniffed away. Bean was fine doing this right in front of the store. But keep in mind, you might have to go across the street in order to be able to do this with your dog. Jellybean, same thing. And Maverick getting some pets.